from the past year. Mm -hmm. School goes from 37th in the league tables to being first for the last two years. Oh, We've even had a letter from Nick Gibb about our very high standards of achievement. The MEN Real School Guide, quality paper by the way, gave us a five star rating and quite rightly so too. Give me that, I want to have a look. We've had Ofsted this year too I think. Oh yeah, it says something about that here. The reports phrases like highly effective and inspirational what a commitment to providing the best possible education for pupils. Parents describe the school as absolutely excellent, welcoming and fun. Don't forget about me. Alright. Mm, yeah, but well, school's always focused on the results in the Ofsted. We do things a little bit differently here. So let's check it out. This is The Floss. The dab is done and it's this dance craze sweeping schools across the country. These pupils in Bury aren't even in double digits yet, but their viral masterclass has been viewed millions of times thanks to their teacher. Cool. <laughs> Me too. Why are you all doing it? I don't really know to be honest. <laughs> just saw people doing it all around the place so I just started doing it. He underwent rigorous training before posting the finished article and becoming the boss of Floss. And how are you coping with millions of people seeing it all over the world? It's, do you know what, it's quite nice that something nice has spread around the world. I think it's lovely that, um, that, that people can see the fun that does happen in schools as well as the quality teaching and learning that happens. It's nice to see the fun stuff. <laughs> Flossing. My children are flossing constantly, and I was delighted initially because I thought it meant yeah. they finally were taking <laughs> dental hygiene <laughs> seriously. <laughs> no. Good point. But no, it's all to do with well, it's been around for a while, but it's been brought back by Fortnite. Look at this. Look at this. This uh, my yeah. niece and nephew, Dylan. Guys, you remember? This is the bit from Toys Got Talent when the teacher did all that silly dancing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look. Oh, I'm sick of these teachers coming in here every morning playing the music really loud. I've put some cameras in, let's see what they've been up to. And now you know what really goes on in school. No, no, this one was my favourite when the teacher did the carpool karaoke. Oh. <laughs> A wimble, 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 a
school. This is where we did the line dancing. Howdy partners, my name is Andy Bell. Do you want to come see some line dancing? Then check this out. We love using green screen in our school. They make our work come alive. Check it out. So you might as well not eat popcorn. Put all the pens in my sack now! Get my reindeers! But all this noise attracts other animals like... Humpback whales. They join the party too. around the world. Hello Amelia, my goodness you've written an absolute cracking story here. Amelia has really written a story with lots of punch to it I would say and you've used really sort of quirky cheeky language which gives me an impression of your character that you've written about. Um, and can, Am I allowed to read Amelia's? Have I got time to read Amelia's as well Mr Hunt? Right so that's his little wig. We go bum and we go up like that and do the trunk. Can you see that? You can make it blow in the wind like that. Look. Oh, absolutely. Yes. I mean, after I read all of those books, I thought, oh no, I think there's some potential picture book authors amongst you. This is when Jamie went down to bet in London. Oh yeah, he performed in front of loads of people. Hey, I'm Joan Barry and welcome to Bet 2018. Dr. Simon Long. So, would you recommend this place to a friend? Oh, absolutely. Uh, you've been here, right? Uh, I came in very early. You, to get the mirror screen up, you swipe up or double click the home button. If you press through there, you check the name of the device that's on the active panel, you click that device. Look at the Infuse Award. Look, Mr. Parrot's on the TV. Uh, fantastic news this year. We managed to uh, put a bid in and win an Infuse Award from STEM. So we're going to be working with four primary schools on an amazing project bringing creativity back into the classroom. You don't need to do it. This is, this is true, Graham. This is exactly what this school philosophy is about. Children learn best when they're happy and having fun. In fact, I think we dedicated a week to it. Yeah, we called it Happiness Week. Look.
always aim high. That's our school motto, and at Tottington, we always do. <laughs>